Good morning, Holy Spirit. Oh God, Lord, we praise you and we praise your word this morning. As we seek refuge in you this day, we call on you, O oh Jehovah Nissi, God our banner, all day long and cast our cares on you by looking to you to sustain us. Amen. Brethren, this morning it is important to know as David tells us in Psalm 56 verse 4 that the word with John tells us that in John chapter 1 verses 1 to 2 that is God is always there with us in our distress. David was hotly pursued by his enemies all day long. That instead of panicking, David said in Psalm 56 verse 4, In God whose word I praise, in God I trust. I will not be afraid. What can mortal man do to me? Brothers and sisters, in times of fear and trouble, the Holy Spirit wants us to praise God for His righteous commands, His righteous promises in His Word, and also you and I will have His Word in our heart at all times. The psalmist knows that God takes notice of his anxieties and worries. And this assures him that God will protect him. Even in our deepest sorrow, God cares. This morning, as we place our trust in God and his written word, Let your trust in God replaces your fear. And as David experienced in verses 13 of Psalm 56, God will deliver your feet from stumbling as you walk before God in the light of life today, on this day. As God becomes your helper, and deliverer as the Lord assured David in the 13th verse of Psalm 56. Remember the truth that God is for you. Even in our deepest sorrow, God cares. Yes, he cares for you. Often we waver between faith and fear Oh yes, God sees, God knows, and God records in writing all our troubles, all our distress and sufferings, every tear shed by a faithful believer such as you and I is treasured by God and carefully preserved in his memory. Yes, he keeps a record so that he can comfort and reward you and I according to our suffering on this earth. Never forget that God looks at us lovingly through all our disappointing experiences, illnesses, sleepless nights, financial trials or hardships, even in our workplace. When you and I feel so discouraged that you are not sure anyone understands, remember that God knows every problem and sees every tear. For every trial, 
God wants you and I to remain faithful to Him. And we will reap abundance of joy at the due time. And in the due time. Yes. David's confidence in God was so secure that he considered his prayer already answered. May God answer your prayer and all your heart desires this morning and this day. Have a wonderful, blessed day. Bye-bye.